PS Bank PLDT Online Payment How to pay your PLDT bills through PS Bank mobile app online And if you are new to this channel and you want more helpful videos like this Please click the subscribe button So gamit ko ngayon yung cellphone ko and na-install ko na rin yung PS Bank mobile app Kung hindi mo pa ito na-install, you can download this from Play Store or App Store So I'll go ahead and open PS Bank mobile app and I'll log in with my username and password and click sign in. So, ito na yung online account ko with PS Bank. So, I'll click OK and I'll tap View Accounts. So, I'll tap this Create a Transaction. And since magabayit ako ng bills, I'll tap this Pay Bills. So, I'll tap this Pay to Unenrolled Biller. And since ang babayaran ko ngayon is sa PLDT, hanapin ko rito yung telecoms. Ito, telco. And here's PLDT. So, I'll tap this. And I'll enter here the subscriber or the account number ko sa PLDT. And for subscriber name, inalagay ko rito yung um, owner ng bill na yon, or kung kanino nakapangalan yung PLDT bill. For telephone or mobile number, ang inalagay ko rito is yung landline number ko doon sa PLDT. Uh, for reference number, ito rin yung statement of account number. Dito sa bandang baba, siya makikita. Um, itong account number sa taas, hindi ito nagbabago monthly, so permanent to. While for reference number or statement of account number, every month nagbabago to. So, balik ako sa online account ko with PS Bank and I'll complete these details. And I'll tap proceed. And I'll enter here 1299 for, my, uh, for the amount. Click done. For transfer schedule, meron dito option like immediate, future date, and recurring date. Ang pipiliin ko is yung immediate. Yung future date, um, ilalagay mo pa yung date dito kung kailan mo gusto mag-reflect yung payment. While for recurring date, like gusto mo every month magbayad na automatically, pwede mo siyang iset up dito by choosing recurring date. But for now, ang pipiliin ko muna is yung immediate. And also, meron ditong option na pwede mo siyang isave as your favorite. So, I'll tap this. And proceed tayo. And a one-time password has been sent to my phone. So, hintayin ko lang yung code. And click submit. So, meron itong confirmation na success. Your transaction has been processed and saved successfully. So, meron itong transaction number. Mas maganda na isave mo yung transaction number or any reference number kapag gumagawa ka ng transactions online. It will serve as your proof at na nagbayad ka nga. So, I'll go ahead and take a screenshot of this. Para masave ko siya sa photos ko. And i-enroll ko na din to as biller. So, I'll tap this. And meron din ang confirmation na na-enroll na siya as my PLDT bill. So, I'll go to my account. So, if I tap this create a transaction and pay bills. Kanina walang nakalagay dito. Pero since tinap ko yung enrolled as biller, na-enroll na dito yung account ko sa PLDT. And that's it. Sana nakatulong tong video na to. If you can think of other videos na pwede naming ituro online, please let us know by providing a comment below. And please also like this video if you think nakatulong tong video na to sa inyo. And these are our other videos on how to pay your PLDT bills online. And also may mga videos din kami about money investment. You can start investing or pwede mo palagayin yung pera mo sa maliit na halaga. And this is Lou from Invest Library. Until next time, bye-bye!